World-class companies are like eagles. They don't flock. You find them one at a time. The excited moments of a new discovery, new accomplishments, and sharing happiness with loved ones are what we cherish. At Suzaru, we are determined to make that happen by delivering the finest quality products that you deserve. Alright guys, hey that was a little dramatic. That was from the intro booklet here. It's your man Jeff with reviewerbereviewed.blogspot.com here to review with you today the Shizaro Finest Craftsman Professional Chef Ceramic Knife. Um, you can see I have a few other things here, items to help us with this review. Um, you'll see, first off is the booklet it's inside. I'll show you the inside in a moment. It's the user's guide. It tells you what you have, tells you a couple cutting techniques, um, some important care and maintenance about ceramic knives. You may not know, but um, ceramic knives are great for a lot of things, but not great for cutting hard things like frozen fruit or meat with bones in it. Some reason cheese they put on here not to use. Um, you can't use marble cutting boards. You have to use soft ones like wood or plastic. Um, they don't recommend putting it in the dishwasher. You can. Anyway, so that's pretty much what you, it is. And then one key thing is ceramic knives can chip. Hence the not hard things. So they want you to make sure to sharpen the knife. So with that, let's get started and sharpen the knife. Um, it comes in a great box here. I think it's actually pretty quality. It would make a great gift. Give us a little... Kid snorting flower or something. I don't know, something. And then, looks like a microfiber cloth for cleaning your blade. Um, blade itself, you'll notice it's very light because of the ceramic nature. Um, it's got like this black shine on it. it has a Shizaro logo here. Also in the handle, on the end of the handle. Um, the handle's made of plastic. Feels pretty solid, a little shaky here. Um, I'm smudging the crap out of it with my fingers, apparently. It's it's very shiny. Feels pretty darn sharp, which I would imagine a new knife should feel like. Um, so let's put it through some paces. Um, it's kind of a foam insert here where the knife goes. Um, it comes with uh, a knife cover, which they say they recommend you store it in at all times when not in use. I feel like I put it in the wrong way, hence the reason it wasn't covering the whole blade. Haha, <laughs> there you go, covering the whole blade. There you go. Another thing about ceramic knives is they don't need to be sharpened nearly as often, but to sharpen them is more difficult because you have to use a diamond blade. All right, let's get on to cutting some stuff and comparing. I got a few of my oldies but goodies knives here, a generic Cuisinart, a single cleaver from Ikea, some really generic knife that we just keep using because it works. And then, of course, the Cesaro knife. So we'll start with this really old, gross-looking yam, but it's a pretty firm object to start with. And I'll make the first cut here with the Cesaro. That cut actually really cleanly, like more than I was anticipating. Let's see how fine I can make this stuff. Oh yeah, look at that. It's pretty fine. Okay, let's see if I can duplicate it. Okay, generic knife. Yeah, okay, that was, that was harder. Ikea knife. Oh, and I sharpened all my knives right before the video so that they would be... You see, that's cutting pretty pretty cleanly as well. It's a little more difficult towards the end, but I got a pretty fine chip there. And then generic Cuisinart knife. Uh, not as good, for sure. <laughs> yeah, one much more difficult. Let's make sure that we weren't... Oh yeah, that just... Finally cuts, I mean, look at the fineness. All right, so that was nice. Let's get rid of this trash. And let's go on to something more normal, like an Asian pear. What's more or less normal about that? Asian pear, test one. Oh, right through it, I mean, it was like nothing. You move the skin and just, mm. love Asian pear. All right, let's try. All right, that cut pretty good. Mm. Like the knife though, that's really stacking up. Um, that's good. Again, this is um, the Suzaro knife. Um, I, I like it, it cut really sharp and cleanly. Um, it was great. It's a little dirty now, but it would make a great gift. Thanks for watching, bye.